Now, where this is all gonna go for the worse here shortly is, unless you like the cold. If you like the cold, we're gonna focus on the good news. People who love the cold, I have great news for you. Temperatures are dropping. We're gonna go down into the 30s for Sunday and Monday, even Tuesday still staying right around 40. So if you like cooler temperatures, great week for you because we are gonna continue on this track, getting a little bit cooler here as we move through the next several days. Even with that though, we will start to warm up, but the key to this is gonna be that these numbers aren't gonna feel like these numbers. 36 already sounds amazing to everybody who loves the cold, but it's gonna start to get even colder here as soon as we go and factor in your wind chill and wind gusts. So let's look at the wind gusts for today. A light breeze here, not really expecting anything major today, but it will be a little bit breezy at times here as you go through your day, but just a light breeze, if anything. As we go into the next couple of days, that's where everything starts to change a bit more. We're gonna have wind gusts getting up to about 35, 40 miles an hour for everybody across the state. A little bit calmer for some people at times, but the next two days are going to be quite breezy. You can see Millinock had got over 40 mile an hour gusts at some point. So Sunday and Monday, just expect two pretty windy days in your forecast and expect it to take your feels like temperatures and lower them even more. So a lot of the time, it's probably going to feel like we're in the 20s instead of the 30s. So just adding insult to injury. Luckily, the good news is we've got lots of sunshine for your day today. So you can focus on that and enjoy the nice weather if you bundle up. It's going to be nice and sunny for your day here for your Saturday. A couple clouds coming in as we go into this evening and overnight. And then we'll have a couple flurries joining into the forecast as well. But with this and the winds, we can expect visibility to be lowered in the mountains as that kind of blows around with those flurries. You can also see a few power outages possible with the winds that we have coming on Sunday and Monday. So just be aware of those two things. Just take a little bit slower if it's real blustery out there and just kind of give yourself a couple extra minutes. As we continue throughout Sunday and then into Monday, we'll see those flurries move out of the way and make room for some sunshine back in the forecast. So it's going to get better. We'll have some more sun coming out on Monday, so it should be nice on that home front.